All right, a lot of you have been asking how do you set the flow for your pressurized well here in your Seapros. Uh, what you do is open the intake or your supply all the way. So the water that's pumping in is wide open. You know, as far open as you can without the plug coming out. So you want it wide open flow. And you're going to adjust it, adjust the level with your standpipe here. There are holes all the way around the fitting. I'll show you here in the video. And when this is tightened all the way, those holes are blocked off. So the only outflow is going to be here. You can see the slots here, the holes all the way around the base. It's really an excellent design. You can kind of see down into the drain hole. You can see the rubber seal here, and then right before it is access to those slots. So as you tighten the uh, standpipe, you know, if you go all the way down, it passes that access to the slots and seals at the rubber gasket. So if you tighten it all the way down, nothing will drain through these holes. It will only drain through the top. So you can completely adjust the level just by loosening or tightening this. So I leave my supply wide open so it's always pumping the maximum amount of water in and I control my level right here with a stamp pipe. You can see right now it's almost to the very tippy top. So if you want your well to run as a pressurized well where there's no air in it, you'll leave it all the way down like this. And when you close it, that'll pump all the way to the surface. See how the air is coming out? See that? And you know, it takes a minute to get up there. And it just squeezes all the air out. If you think that you're gonna have the flow on wide open and restrict the outflow and it's just gonna stop at the surface, it won't. You can put two grown men on that lid and this pump is strong enough to lift you and water will leak out. They're not designed to, to have a great amount of pressure in there, probably harm your bait or your catch anyway. It's designed to get all the air out. So you wanna set the level first, make sure the level stops right about flush with the surface, maybe a little faster, and then go ahead and close the lid and you'll see all the air comes out. If it's pumping too fast, loosen your standpipe. So if I want it to flow faster, I loosen the standpipe. <laughs> And now it gives the water access to those holes down there. And I loosened it quite a bit right now so it goes quicker and I can show you. And you'll see the level start to drop. There it goes. It's sloshing a little bit, but you can see how now it's getting more sloshy as we're letting more air in here. See it? You see how it's below this now because it's going out of those holes. So you just adjust it, tighten it back up, it'll raise. Just go ahead and get that set the way you want it, and you're good to go. You could also adjust this so there's only two inches of water in there. Set it for three inches. If you only have a few baits left and you just want to have a couple inches of water, loosen your standpipe and adjust it. Really fantastic design, super simple, works perfectly every time. Side. Leave you stranded at roadside as she gets in your mind.